So, there is a product that is about to launch, but you can't just launch a product like that. You want to create captivating visuals to show off what you have worked so hard on. Now, how do you create such visuals that make your customers stop scrolling, pull out their wallet and throw their money at you? If you can stick with me for the next 5 minutes, I will show you how I do it. A couple weeks ago, I got a DM from Tisha, a long-time client of mine, and she said, Hi Sav, I'm excited to reach out for a lead product launch happening in January. Are you available? Of course I'm available. So here is the objective. LYS Beauty is launching a new lipstick and lip liner in the next three weeks, and my job is to create the most captivating and engaging visuals for their brand. To do this, I brought together the dream team, Mihai for modeling and texturing, David for animation, and myself for creative direction, and also animation. Immediately I got the reference photos from the clients, I sent it to Mihai to create the 3D models. While I jumped on the internet looking for inspiration. If you are still watching right now, I'm sure you can understand what I mean when I say looking for inspiration can be a headache. I spent hours on Behance and YouTube trying to find videos that match the sleek energetic look I was going for. After this, I started sketching. I always sketch every project on paper first. It keeps me sane. Around the same time, I got a message from Mihai. All the models were done and were looking awesome. After a few corrections, we were ready to go. Time to call my co-animator. Hey yo David, there's a new project on ground. Are you up for it? Awesome, awesome, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. I sent him half of the storyboard to work on while I animated the rest. He quickly got this done in about 10 days and got back to me with the shots. Let's jump into Blender real quick so you can see the behind the scenes. By the way, if you learned something from this video so far, please drop a like right now, it actually helps me out a ton. For this shot, I wanted to stack the lip liners like a triangle, which is an important aspect of the LYS brand. You can do this by adding an array modifier to two copies of the lip liner, then duplicating and rotating them 60 degrees to form a perfect equilateral triangle. Triangle. All that's left is just some rotation animation. Oh yeah, the background is basically just concentric circles with an emissive material. Same thing with this shot, just that I use triangles instead. I've talked about this explosive shot on my channel before. Go watch my phone animation tutorial to get the gist of how it was done. This shot was quite interesting. I took a simple bezier curve and bent it like this to look like it was unwrapping. Then I took a plane and made it really long and added a curve modifier to it targeting the curve. Then I just duplicated this all over the place and parented the lip liners to it with a little location animation. And boom, we have this. Another very cool shot that people really liked was the last shot here. To create this, you need a 3D version of your logo. Check out this video, it shows you exactly how to get that done. After that, I just needed to pull the logo from underneath a plane and make sure they both have the same texture. Then there were a bunch of texturing and lighting tricks. If you want to know how to light a scene like me, check out my lighting tutorial. After a long ride of rendering, I took all the clips and edited them to a dope music track. Now, the moment of truth. What will T-Shirt think? Okay, here we go. I love it. It's fantastic. Yes, she loves it. But just to confirm, I believe we are good to go, yeah? Obsessed. Thank you. Yes, we are all set. Awesome. The video went ahead to reach tens of thousands of people. Mission accomplished. This was a successful project. Let's take a look at the final videos delivered. Awesome guys, we are good to go and that's how you take a project from start to finish. Find the right references and inspiration, work with smart people and make sure you and your clients understand what you are trying to achieve. If you learned something from this video, please drop a like if you haven't already, it actually helps my channel grow. So guys, I will see you in the next one. Peace.